Hey everybody, Jamie here. Sorry I've been quiet the last few weeks. Been a busy few weeks. Today I'm in the wonderful small town called Ashton. This is about a mile away from my local church. So um, it's been on my heart recently to go into the streets and give out tracts and share the gospel. Um, and tonight we're having a film night at our church. So I thought tonight, today would be a good opportunity to just go into the streets and just um, give some advertisements out. I know it's not um, yeah. the claiming, hey, the gospel, but for me personally, this is a, a process and it's a start. So I'm just going to see what conversations okay. come out. And I'm here with my son and he's going to help me give out some advertisements, see if we can invite some kids along because we we care for the kids in this local area. So let's see how it goes. Bye bye. Okay, we've got one more left. Yeah, one more left. Yeah. Are you okay? Have you got any young grandchildren? Pardon? Any young grandchildren? I um, was. We're doing a film night at our church this evening, um, like a kids' film, if they're interested. Um, they, they live in Wigan, you say? All oh, right, okay. Yeah. Yeah. They're, they're, they're what? Um, they're 12 and 13. Oh, yeah, Nearly might 14. be a little bit too old. Yeah, uh, that's no problem. Okay, All right, thank bye. you anyway. Take too care. Old. Bye. Too old. Too old. So. We've just give out now how many how many did we give out? About thirty advertisements and there was a lot of good reception. A lot of people were very polite, which you would expect to be honest. Some good conversations and it felt good actually. No one um had a go at me or whatever and people asked where's where's your church? A lot of people asked where's your church? So now we at least we've promoted that. So it's a nice little Go on, know what? It's a nice little win. Felt good, growing. So next time we go, we have to give out tracks. Well, let's see how that goes. So hopefully we have a good turnout tonight. And I'll let you know if any people attend who said they'd bring the children. Good experience. Say hi, Noah. What? Say hi to the camera. Hi. Say see you after. Hello, everyone. So... The results are in, uh, our film night's over. You might ask, how many turned up? Well, all the invites I gave out, zero turned up. Um, we had 20 plus 30 people, about 11 children, obviously, which is great to see because even if there's a couple of children, then we're doing that for them because we're showing them that as Christians that we care for the kids and Hopefully they take it on board, maybe now or in the later life. So going back to the point where no one showed up, you might be asking, does that demoralise you or um, drain you of confidence? Or Well, there's two things that I want to take away from nobody showing up and me giving out the invites. Um, the first thing is um, the long term. We don't know what seed that has planted. Okay, I only told them that what church you go to and what we were doing, but who knows who God may put in their lives next week, next year, in a few years. So that could just be a tiny little seed, who knows. And the second point is maybe this just was a test for me personally. When Jesus went in the wilderness, um, that was a, a trial, that was a test. Um, so I feel like that could have been a test for me and hopefully I've come through it stronger. And I obviously will come through it stronger because I did it. <laughs> and that's something I want you to take away if you're watching this now. Sometimes you just need to just do it. However uncomfortable or how little confidence you have in doing it, you just got to be brave and go out there and do it. And we're all just in a... All of us personally are in a scenario where we're gradually growing as Christians day by day growing into the image of Jesus. Obviously, we will never be like that because we're sinners, but we're just being sanctified and we're growing daily. So this has helped me grow. And I help. I hope that you can, whatever it is that's on your heart, that you will be brave and do it yourself. Because as Christians, we're not called for an easier life. We're not called to live a comfortable life. Um, sometimes we need to go into these situations when we don't feel like or we don't have the courage to so i enjoyed it so 
that's just a stepping stone for me. Let's see what happens next. So take care. See you later. Bye-bye.